Hello and welcome to the Cinema 4D Quick Tips. Sometimes you may have a character with some Mixamo animation applied to it and you want to adjust the animation. But how can you do this? It's actually very easy. Let's pause the animation and go back to frame 0. And let's bring up the timeline in order to deactivate the animation with this button here. And then let's select the weight tag here and let's reset the whole character to its bind pose. So now it's in its bind pose. From here we can start creating the rig and therefore we will go to the character menu here and create a character object. And you can see that the template is already set to Mixamo control rig. So now we can create the rig. Therefore let's add the components. We start with the root, then the pelvis, then we hold down command or control and shift and create the legs. So this way we create symmetrical legs, but the pelvis will be selected. Command to create the arms and without any shortcut we will create the hands. So now the complete structure is finished, but it doesn't fit the bind pose as you can see. Therefore we have to go to adjust and now it all snapped into place. But there's one little thing that we need to adjust in order to make it work properly. Therefore we go to the side view and move the knee joints a bit forward, like this. Let's go back to perspective view because otherwise the IK will make the knees bend backwards in this case and that's not what we want. And now we skip the binding tag and directly go to animate so we are almost finished. Just two more things need to be adjusted and therefore we go to the root object here and first of all retarget the whole rig. And then we drag and drop the body geometry here to the weight tags field and click transfer weights. And now the whole thing is already finished and we can start modifying the rig. So if I select the pelvis here for example and move it you can see that it works. Maybe let's make the Mixamo rig invisible here and you can see it works. Let's undo this and let's activate the animation again and get rid of the timeline. Press play and you can see that all of the controllers move with the animation. And now what we can do is we can create variations. So for example I can make this guy like this and rotate the head a bit and if I hit play, you can see that he will walk like this now. Thanks for watching. If you enjoy our quick tips, please like, comment and subscribe.